This park has come a long ways in the past two years. It's like an epicenter, really, for Jacksonville. If it wasn't for the Friends of Hemming Park creating events like this, people wouldn't have anything to come to. It needs to be better managed. It has been a resounding success. My experience has been great. It's been very good. It should be thoroughly supported by the city. You, you come downtown and there, there are people in the middle of the day walking around the heart of the city, and that didn't used to happen. Somewhere you could come, sit down, and just enjoy Jacksonville. It's a very, very important part of the chain of revitalizing the urban core. And we know what to do. It's taken us a while to get there, and we've made a few mistakes. But right now, we're on the threshold of turning Hemming Park not just into a pleasant place to come visit, but a true attraction that will make people come downtown and see what a wonderful urban space this is. I've been volunteering and I got people from Gainesville, from Orange Park, from Nocatee all coming to my tent. So this is not just about downtown and Riverside, this is about all of Jacksonville. We met a friend down here and we're all from the Jacks Beach area. It's their first year, we're all allowed to make mistakes and for the last several decades the city's done a really poor job and in the last two years friends have done this absolutely incredible job. I'm really proud of what the Friends of Hemming have done so far. We need to give it at least two years to know whether it's going to go or whether it's not going to go. Because as I come down here, my mom's like, watch where you go, watch this. And it's just like, Mom, it's cool. Like, there's people around. It's not as dead as it used to be. Uh, before, this place was kind of scary. You know, there's been some dubious spending going on, but um, overall, uh, I think it's been a good, good run here with all the different events they're having down here. Hemming Park is basically a language, and it's a language spoken by the programming that's conducted here. So let's invest it, because we'll get it back. Because I think people use this park just as much as they use the amphitheater and the Everbank, if not more. Please, please, please listen to the city of Jacksonville when it comes to Hemming Park. You normally attract a diverse crowd, so that's good, because Diversity in Jacksonville is a big thing. So, so bottom line, let's support Hemming Park, let's support making a difference, and let's support embracing diversity. Absolutely. The positive outlook that we get from people that come here to visit is priceless.